my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna be doing a classic look for New Year's Eve. Red lips, eyeliner, and a touch of gold on the eyes. And I call it last minute because all the product, you may sure have it at home already. So you wanna do how we do this, just keep on watching. We're gonna start by primer and preparing our lips. You can use any eye primer or paint pot. And then we're gonna set it with a peach eyeshadow and blend the crease, just a soft touch. And then we're gonna start creating our car crease effect. Gonna use the first one, a lilac product, and blend it into the crease. And then I'm gonna move on to a dark brown and start intensifying this cut crease effect. Make sure you don't get any product in the lid, okay? Apply a little bit and blend out. Apply a little bit more and blend out. We're gonna go back to the pitch and help us to blend this cut. And then add a goldy tone as a highlighter Next is going to be apply a glitter glue all over the lid to hold on our glitter or uh, pigment. I'm going to use this gold pigment. You can use any type of gold product that you will have, pigment, eyeshadow, glitter, anything. And then just blend the crease with a little bit more product to make sure you have a big difference between the gold and the brown. And then we're going to create an intense eyeliner. I'm gonna get the guy from the bottom lash line all the way up until the upper lash line and connect the outer wing into the rest of the eyeliner. I'm gonna create a very intense one, but you can adjust it as your style, thinner, longer, shorter, as you want. But I'm gonna add a really intense eyelashes, so I need to have a big eyeliner. Clean up from the liner to the bottom of the rest of the product it can be pulled down and apply a highlight pencil on the bottom line. A touch of the dark eyeshadow on the bottom lash line and we move in to do our eyebrows. In this case I'm gonna go for an intense eyebrow but of course you can adjust it at your style. And then I'm gonna give a little bit of brush into the eyebrows just to get a more natural finish. I'm gonna apply a little bit of concealer on the neat just to create a precise Define uh, finish on the eyebrows and I'm gonna apply this uh, the same concealer to cover my dark circle areas Apply your foundation as you normally do in this case I'm going to spend a little bit of longer time to really blend the product into my skin because I want a completely natural flawless finish and then I'm gonna set it uh, with the translucent loose powder. That will make your foundation to last longer. And then I'm gonna give up some volume to my face by contouring and I'm gonna do a little heavier than normally. I'm gonna do it all over around my face, leaving the central more light and highlighter. And I'm gonna apply a soft neutral blush before we doing our bold red lips. First thing I'm gonna be doing is to line my entire lips and fill them in with a lip liner. And then once we have this, I'm gonna take a permanent or long-lasting lipstick and I'm gonna apply all over my lips. Use a concealer around the lips to prevent from bleeding. That will hold on the color on your lips. And then use the same lip liner we used previously to make sure we have perfect lines around it. And now we have perfect red lipstick. Apply a fix just to hold on your makeup, curl your lashes and apply mascara. I'm going to be applying false lashes, but you can skip this if you don't feel comfortable with them. Gonna chosen a big one, that's why I did a big eyeliner. And then we're done. For the hairstyle, I just uh, create a low ponytail on one side, split the base and get the entire ponytail inside and twist it. Just curl the base and add some nice bow and we are done. Well guys, I hope so much that you like this video. Thumbs up if you liked it. Remember, you can do any type of look with the product that you have already at home. So if you do recreate this look, please share it with me. I would love to see it. Remember, my social media are Twitter, Instagram, on Facebook. Please have a great, great, great New Year's Eve. And we'll see you back in 2014 for tons of new videos. Be happy!